Good afternoon, guys. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to this week's grocery haul. Thank y'all so much for being here. We are bracing for Ian, but you know, he's just going to be like a tropical stormish by the time he gets to us, but we're expecting a lot of rain. So it's Friday. I'm going to get my tail in in Walmart and out of Walmart and I'm going to get home and get our groceries in. And we're just going to have a lazy weekend this weekend. I'm dropping these kids off this morning at Mother's Morning Out, so that gives me a chance to get in and out of Walmart without a whole bunch of hassle, especially if it's raining. I won't have to drag them in and out, so that's good. So. treating myself this morning because it has been a minute since I've been to Duncan so I don't even feel bad about it. Good morning. Thanks for choosing Duncan. Can I help you? Hi. Yes, ma'am. I have a, a app order for Jennifer. Here we go, Jen. Thank you. Thank have you so much. One. You too. Listen, B. So, I got a bacon, egg, and cheese wake-up wrap and some hush brown. It has found so good. Oh my god. I'm parked at Walmart and I'm fixing to go in. I just finished my breakfast, but I realized that I never shared with you guys what coffee I ordered. I'm sorry, I'm half asleep. But I got an iced blue latte and that's just an OG for me. So you just order an iced latte with blueberry and caramel, and it's pretty much always good. It's one of my favorites. Thanks to Mackenzie to turn me on to it. I have a pickup order scheduled between 10 and 11, but Walmart's wanting to play games with me this morning and tell me that they don't have my coffee creamer, so. Anything to get me in the store, right? When I was at Aldi this past week, I noticed they had a caramel apple pie. They have one here at Walmart too, and it looks so good. That'd be so delicious warmed up. And then they also have this apple pie bar here, and they also have a lemon Pie bar. I've not seen those before. Well, what do we have here? <laughs> they have my creamer. It looks like they just got some me in there. Seriously, they. I already got out there. Southern Comfort eggnog. One is vanilla spice and one's just a traditional. Get her out of here. She's coming in here acting like she got all this money. Spending all this money up on her. Her is me. Get her out of here. Alright, I made it back in one piece. Y'all can rest assured that you will not catch me outside tomorrow. <laughs> no ma'am. No sir. I don't do this type of weather. It's rainy outside already, and it's supposed to be, like, even worse tomorrow. I think we're supposed to get, like, between four and five inches of rain. So, pray that my basement doesn't flood. <laughs> Thanks. All right, really quick, I wanted to go over our meal plan for this coming week. I haven't wrote it on the board, so I'm just sitting here looking at it on my little paper thing on my refrigerator. Saturday is when we start our meal plans out around here. We're going to do a vegetable beef stew. Sunday will be leftovers. Monday, we're going to do, I found a recipe for some barbecue chicken grilled cheese sandwiches. Looks really good. I can't wait to try that out. Tuesday is going to be French bread sloppy joes. Wednesday, I don't know yet. I don't know. I'm going to be pantry cooking that night because I didn't plan anything. There's nothing written down. <laughs> Got it together. And then Thursday night will be every man for himself, but y'all know how that goes. I'll probably end up be grilling somebody a grilled cheese sandwich or a quesadilla or something. And then Friday nights, we always leave that open to go pick up something or go out. Oh, just look out there. It's a mess. And I meant to get my cushions in <gasps> and I completely forgot. We have to make kind of a little barricade. For Stevie when we're grilling so she don't get to our grill but oh my gosh it's just dreary outside 
but I will admit we have um, not seen rain in a while, so it's not terrible, I guess. Okay, today's grocery total. Brace yourselves. <laughs> $311. I finally found this Pepperidge Farm Swirl Pumpkin Spice Bread. I am really excited to make some French uh, French toast with that in the morning. Um, I've got some sourdough sandwich bread for those um, barbecue chicken sandwich, uh, grilled cheeses, or whatever. They substituted my French bread. I ordered this, and they gave me this. But while I was in the store, I went over there, and there was a bunch. So they must have just, like, put them out. It's still... I don't know. I think they bake them there. It's still, maybe it's just my head, but I feel like it's still warm. And then I just went ahead and kept the everything bread. I'm going to slice it up. I like to make little sandwiches and stuff with that. Because um, <laughs> I forgot to get loaf bread. <laughs> yes. Got some um, potatoes. I'm going to cut some potatoes up and put in our um, vegetable beef stew. Bananas as always. Broccoli. We've got, that's just for snacking. Got some grapes. That's all the fruit and vegetables. Don't judge me. <laughs> um, I'm going to make some. Oh, you know what? I ordered strawberries. Where's my strawberries at? Talk on. While I was in Walmart, I was trying to think up something that we could, like, bake this weekend just for, to have something to do. And I was like, ooh, a strawberry cobbler. And I needed self-rising flour for that. I don't want any strawberries now. <laughs> it's okay. Everything's fine. Got some cosmic brownies and some fudge rounds. And then I also went and picked, went ahead and picked up some beef um, ramen. I got a box of the onion soup mix. I put this in my vegetable beef stew. And the, <laughs> I'm not sure what happened here, but this box is like torn all apart. But it looks like all of the bars are still there. But these are the blueberry fruit and grain bars. We've got some mini powdered donuts. These are like Hayden's absolute favorite. And then Harrison loves these Captain Crunch treats. I got those for him. Got a couple of... Even though it's like still like a month out from Halloween, I'm like thinking in my head, if I don't go ahead and get some of this stuff now, it's going to be gone. So I got some cookie icing. I got purple and green. And I went ahead and picked up some of these eyeball sprinkles. I thought they were really cute. A little eyeball on top. And then I got some of this orange frosting with the cute little sprinkles on top. Got some sugar cookie mix because I figured we would make the sugar cookies. I know it's like Christmas themed that's weird why they got that out <laughs> christmas themed already um i guess winter themed and then we're gonna decorate with the with the icing and the the sprinkles got some funfetti chocolate cake mix and it comes with the colored bits <laughs> i got some manwich sloppy joe sauce for the french ba french bread um sloppy joes one night um i passed by these <laughs> And they just miraculously ended up in my cart, but they're the Reese footballs. And then this was a substitution. I ordered the great value. They gave me Mott's. Um, we got some more Hershey's Simply Five for chocolate milk. And then I saw this one while I was in the store and I was like, you know what? It's time to start making a couple of um, hot coffees. I've been doing iced coffee for a while and I don't know, it's starting to get cool outside, so we're going to make some warm coffee. This is salted caramel mocha at Starbucks. I wanted to try it. It looks good. And then I've never noticed the Black Rifle Coffee Company coffee in my Walmart. I don't know if this is something new, but I went ahead and picked it up. It's the just black one. And then the app said that they were out of my Dunkin' Extra Extra. So <laughs> y'all know I had to go investigate because I didn't get it last week either. I don't know what's going on. So I went ahead and got the extra extra and the pumpkin munchkin just to make sure I have plenty. I got the green stoke. They gave me the purple. I got some cinnamon rolls here. I've got two original and then I ordered three original, but they gave me one of them in cream cheese and the bottom of it's kind of janked up a little bit. So I may request a refund on that one. I don't know about that. I've got some tomato juice here. That's for the vegetable beef stew. I got some of the pecan turtle delight cookies. Jeff really liked those. And I am just so thankful for you guys um, giving me the idea of buying some extra pumpkin cookie dough and freezing it because guess what? That I got three of them this week. We're going to throw those in the freezer for later. So thank y'all so much for suggesting that. I got some more sour cream because we were out. Butter, we were out of that. Um, we've got some more eggs here, and then I really like having this, um, uh, fully cooked, uh, 
bacon on hand for a quick breakfast in the morning. Needed some more turkey pepperoni. We just like to kind of snack on that. And then I needed the Havarti for the barbecue chicken um, grilled cheese sandwiches. And then more bacon because we love bacon. And then I um, needed some more shredded cheese to use for a couple of recipes this week. Back here in the back, we've got some Diet Dr. Peppers in just a little small bottles. I got a six pack of the Sam's Cola and a six pack of the Dr. Thunder. And then the 12 packs are still cheaper than buying the 24 packs. So I got two of those. It's like 50 cents cheaper or something, but still, it's cheaper. This is the stew meat that I'm going to be throwing in my soup. I cannot wait. I'm like so excited and then we've got some oh and i saw these i hadn't i did not see these during the spring this year i guess i just wasn't looking hard enough because i'm sure that they had them out but this is my absolute favorite flavor of the bluebell ice cream it's the bride's cake <laughs> it's so good you guys so stinking good and then we got a couple of boxes of these mini um like we used to call them nutty buddies um chocolate dipped Ice cream cones with the nuts on top. We got a couple of those because these are like, they're tiny, but they're the perfect amount of ice cream. Like seriously, you don't feel like ridiculous or feel really bad about eating it afterwards. So <laughs> I got some more mixed vegetables for the soup. I got some extra crispy fr fresh fruit fries, fresh fruit fries, uh, throw it back in the freezer. And then you guys had recommended that I try the blueberry pancakes and sausage on a stick. So I got those this week because we're kind of running low on the box that I got from Sam's not too long ago. And then I got these Klondike minis to throw in the freezer for the kiddos to see if they like those. And then for the strawberryless cobbler, I've got some homestyle vanilla ice cream. <laughs> I've got some more lotion. Jeff had requested I pick this up. I don't know. He saw it somewhere and said, hey, see if you can find Blue Emu at Walmart. I was like, okay. So I will. Oh, and that reminds me. Um, my son, my 10-year-old, has been complaining of his legs hurting. Like, every single day. Like, from his knees, just kind of just hurting. And I'm like, dude, what is going on with you? Y'all, he has done grown four inches since his birthday in January and that's like the biggest spurt of growth he's had like his entire life like within a year within half a year I guess or whatever it is is that not crazy I am wanting to put money on it that that is growing pains it's got to be growing pains but anyway poor fella he's he's um now taller than me my dad I uh, got these for my little neighbor's little Dotson that comes over and hangs out with me every once in a while. We ran out of them. And these are like really, he likes them a lot and they are pretty good for him, I think. They don't have a bunch of junk in them. So, and he's on a little diet. His mama says that he's nine pounds overweight and he's got to lose some weight. So I don't feel so bad giving him those because it's not that terrible for him as far as you know fattening and stuff um <laughs> need some more dishwasher packs i've got some pizzas up here i picked up whoa i picked up the five cheese di stuffed crust and when i saw this one i said oh jeffrey will like that it's the sam's choice stuffed crust chicken bacon ranch pizza i figured he'd like that and then the last thing we've got here is some paper towels well, guys, that is going to do it for this week. I feel like I did really good this week as far as what I got. Um, yeah, I did spend a little bit more money than I wanted to, but, you know, it is what it is. But thank you all so much for being here. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, make sure to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. If you enjoy grocery hauls, we share these every single week on this channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, y'all.